I, I, I want to preface this because um, as Tony mentioned in the regular part that we're, we're Mason alums and uh, one of the incoming freshmen, actually he's on the team now, Blake Jones, he played for the Brisbane Bullets. Uh, I was going through the games that you guys played last year. And I think of the four games, I think you, I saw you guys play. I think he only played in one of them. So this is a really long shot, but do you remember playing against him uh, this past season and any sort of takeaways, if you do remember? Yeah, I actually blocked his shot in the layup. So um, kind of got him on that one. So yeah, no, nah, he, he's, he's, he's a good junior. Like he's well known in the juniors, I know for his length and his athleticism. So I think he'll do really well at college. It'll take him, it might take him some time to adjust. Uh, but I think playing for the Bullets and being around a professional team has helped him. Will will help him, you know, you know, in college. And so, having been through the college experience, what do you kind of foresee as being maybe the you know looking back on your experience and looking in on his? What do you see the transition being like uh, for him in terms of where he needs to be? Like in terms of if you're going to give him advice, like as in focus on this or don't focus on that. Yeah, I think you just got to keep working. Like, it doesn't matter if you play, if you don't play, um, if you're getting 10 points, 20 points, zero minutes. Like, you just got to keep going next day. Go, hey, I'm going back to the gym. Like, you just got to stay ready at every opportunity because as a freshman, you may play, you might not play. You might play junk time minutes, you know, stuff like that. You might get frustrated. Um, but, yeah, as long as you trust the work, you know, it's kind of just being a professional, right? So just continue to go to classes, continue to do this continue to work out that's really all i can provide like because when coaches see that like hey you're not sulking you know you're not you know talking crap about them like they go okay this kid's ready like whenever we need him we'll put him in and then when they put you in you do your job boom you're going to get another chance another chance and eventually next thing you know you're playing you know 20 plus minutes so and like you said this is this is probably putting words in your mouth but i'm sure you well, I should say, I think you're probably likely to agree. Having had a, basically a little bit of the professional experience before he actually got to college should probably help him in that regards. Yeah, no doubt. And obviously, I was a development player with the Perth Wildcats before I went to college. So it's kind of been around a professional team. Obviously, that year, Perth ended up winning the championship. And I kind of got to taste like the championship, you know, glory with them a little bit and just being in an environment like that. So, yeah, the Brisbane Bullets, I think, you know, had a great coach, Andre Lamanis, um, had a great assistant, CJ Bruton, and you have great players who've gone to the Olympics or represented Australia, like, for sure, like, he should be ready. 